Good morning, sir. Good morning. Please sit down. Gilbert Ezu, right? Yes, sir. I have gone through your curriculum vitae. And I must be honest with you, I am not really impressed about what I have on this file. Especially when you talk about your guarantors. You didn't tell us where they live or what they do for a living. They both live here in Onitsha. The other one is my uncle and another is my late father's friend. Mr. Ezu, how was I supposed to know that? I am not a prophet. You see, Mr. Ezu, I do not give these goods out on credit for the fun of it. The fact is, I detest poverty. I cannot stand to see anyone around me poor. But I'm also very keen on knowing that anyone I give opportunity must make the best use of it. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Yes, hey, Jalan. Hello, sir. The marketer is here to see you. Oh, Annabelle. Uh, send her in shortly. Okay, sir. Thank you. Mr. Ezu? My secretary will tell you what to do. Okay, sir. Thank you so much, sir. God will continue to bless you for kindness to people. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going now. Thank you. You're welcome. I said I should give you this one fire. <laughs> oh, Mogo. Hey, Moke Maloma de Kawani. Oh, you're full of failure. If you're full of a lady. The man after the people's heart. Come on, sit down. Thank you. <laughs> Maybe he has a bunch of Oh, getting better. Excuse, I've been here before her. I've been waiting here for long. Just calm down, okay? Relax. You don't know her relationship with the boss. Please. Yes. Lady came here this morning. Who is she and what did she want? She came in connection with a casual from Tokima. Uh huh. I saw that has been supplying some people goods on credit. She came to know if we can supply her goods on credit soon. <laughs> Listen, Anthony. Hmm? I don't run an NGO. This is not a charity organization. If she wants credit, she should go to the bundle. I am not with the bundle. I am his wife. Eh? And both of us have different approaches to business. No credit, come tomorrow. And when she comes tomorrow, she should come the following day. And the next day. And when she comes the next day, she, you know the drill. So don't come to me with this kind of um, thing. Because I have things to clear. You're telling me about uh, credit. Come, go to your desk. Ah, don't annoy me this, this, this anymore. 
when she explained her problems to me, you were the only one that came to mind. I know Bond's bank very well. If she fails to meet up that target by the end of this month, she will be fired. So you're asking me to deposit 100 million naira into a bank I have never used in my life? Or just because you want to save a friend's job? Udubondo, you have done more than this for many people. I believe you can do this for a trusted banker who can be of immense help to you tomorrow. Hey, 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 hey. Don't try to weaken me with sentiments and emotions. All right, I'll discuss with my managers and then we see what we can do about it. But I'm not used to doing business with any bank I know nothing about. I just want you to save a friend. I mean, the agony of her losing her job is something I cannot bear. <laughs> Thank you. Emeka Udu. Okolo Mokem. Udu Bundle. Mokem. The Bundle Man of Ado. Mokem no Toto. Oh, you're the Goluma. If he fell, he fell, but if he forgot, he'll leg it. He might not want any notice. It is well with you, my brother. It is well with you. Sit down, my brother. Thank you. So, to what do I owe this honor now, Jason? Please, my brother, don't allow your heart to skip. All is well. Mm. I saw people trooping in and out of your office. Even as we speak, there are people that are still there at your reception waiting. I don't understand it. What is going on? My brother, what can we do? Since God has given some of us enormous resources, the only responsibility we have is to redistribute the wealth. That is the sermon the Almighty God has asked me to go forward and preach. Really? Yeah. I still don't understand what you mean by that. Oh yeah, they are the people I give goods on credit. My brother, people have no reason to be unsuccessful. You mean you have been giving them your goods on credit? To God be the glory. For how long has this been going on? A very long time. At this hard time? The more reason why we should give at this hard time. My brother, I feel very at this time. When I see people suffer, my heart is disheartening. When I see people suffer, it disheartens my heart. And um, I think what some of us should do to make this society a better place is to give. That way we salvage the situation. <laughs> I don't even know why I was looking confused. I forgot you are the bundle. If I don't care about that, can you pick it? Oh, Polo, we should not be talking at an empty table. You know that. Kevin gave me a little gorge. No, the day is still young. Forget about drinks. Oh, come on. Keki, yes, he'll be able to do. Sine man, we fair. All right, uh. Hey, Gorgi. $10,000. Oh, for the Oh, for the money. Oh, for the money. Oh, the money. Oh, for the money. Oh, the money. Oh, for 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 the Okay. But this will not prevent me from telling you the main reason I came here. Oh, oh. Well, if I can alone, go ahead and talk. I believe you remember the children's wears container that I told you about. Yeah. Oh, the one from Turkey. Exactly. Good. I have been having series and series of problems clearing that container. You can talk to me. Talk to me. What's the problem? Look, whatever it is. I have been having series and series of problems with that container. What's wrong? Talk to me as your brother. When we take a long. Nah, all these custom guys. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. sleep. I'll talk to the boys. No, they try to get. Is this happening for real? In fact, what is even happening? Am I aware of all this? 
where was I when they started happening? Emeku do that I know how he started? He started from the slum. The boy that could not even boast of a single meal in a day. The boy that used to approach me for small money. After our masters settled us, this same boy has now blown to the extent that he now gives goods on credit to people. Hey, this is totally unbelievable. I, Opoloka, even had to go to him for financial assistance. One card away, war. So we're looking at 200 million naira. 200 million naira for all the stock in that shop? Yes, sir. Shika, that's too poor. So we have lots of debts to collect. How much debt? Actually, I expected goods of about 500 million naira in that particular shop. So we actually sold lots of goods and credits. But I promise, before you return, I'll make sure I collect everything. I promise. I trust you. You have never failed. Make me proud once more before we your settlement. I promise I will. I'll be away to Dubai for two weeks. When I return, we settle your settlement. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Okay. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. All right. Okay, so what are you Oh, here go. Yeah, we can open. Oh, that time he say me, I know they call you again. Wait, wait, wait. This is my 
Where's my brother's house? That's so. So who are you to stop me from seeing my brother? Your brother they come out. Just go back. Ah. No, 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 no. You know they go anywhere. Else. Ah. Go here. You know they go anywhere. Else. Ah. Oh. What's happening there? Organa, oh, this your sister. Where is the man? I know they allow them inside this compound. These people, when they come, they disturb you. Carry their problem, come here. Where should they go? I'm not going to allow them. Over. Let her go. Come, leave her. Because what are you doing here? Brother, how can you ask me that kind of a question? Am I prohibited from coming to see you? Not without invitation. Have I not said that to you before? Have I not? Yes, you have. But there's something very important. And that's why I needed to come and see you without an invitation. And you came with bag? That means you've already made up your mind you're not going back today. You want to stay? No problem. Go in and wait. The housekeeper is there. I'm about going out. When I come back, let me know the exact reason you have to go against my orders. Go in. Hey, brother. I hope there is food in this house because I leave the village very early. <laughs> you guys come here. Come here. Why are you so much concerned about that? Look at how big you are getting. Obesity has become a global disease. And if you become obese, you will end up in the house. Continue to eat. I know, brother. Dustin. Have these people preparing your meals? Mm -hmm. But just during the week because my schedule is very, very tight. But I don't see anything wrong with that. Must a woman cook in a house where you can easily get someone to do it for you? <laughs> Lazy bones. <laughs> I know you're going to support that. I just pray you get a man who can afford your expensive lifestyle. Amen. Mama, you said everyone is fine at home? Yes, everybody is fine, my son. My late husband's brother, Ichiogo, said I should greet you all. Mm. Mm. I hope he's enjoying his new car. Sister, <laughs> you should see how he pampers that car. As if it is a new bumble. And sings brother's name everywhere he goes. Erika, <laughs> <laughs> Amanda said you're traveling to Dubai. Yes, tomorrow night. But you just came back. Mm. Mama, that has been my fate in this household. You cannot catch a Emeka in this house for one full month. Yeah, one month at Chikalon, no way. <laughs> that has been a, my fate here. Well, mm. that's the price you pay when you do too many businesses. I understand. May God always guide and protect you. Mm. Amen. Mm -hmm. Do you still remember what I told you about obesity when I was living? Do you? 
Mm, Madam, welcome. I don't even know you have returned. How will you know? No, how will you know I am back when all you do is to sit down and eat? Eat as if your life depends on food and food alone. You know, most times I wonder why God punished me with a sister like you. I don't know where I went wrong. Marry. Ugoji will not marry. Do something tangible for herself. Ugoji will not do anything. Well, what else do you know how to do? If not to sit in one place and eat and eat and eat. What's the matter with you? Hey. Well I'm not the only one that has this kind of problem. Ah, after all, you're older than I am. And you have still not gotten married, have you? Then marry, marry, go to marry, marry, marry. Okay. Ugoshi, you are not comparing yourself with me, right? Listen to me, my dear. You are a woman, and I am a man. You are a maiden, and I am a masquerade. We are not the same at all. The time of women passes. Women have no time at all. And the way I am seeing you, your own time has even expired. What are you doing? I am, I, I am actually waiting for that man that will elect to settle for a, a body like you. Because you are a body. You are my sister and I know you inside out. Who is that man that will come for this one? God forbid, brother. If it is a curse, I reject it. Ah! I will get married someday. God forbid what? Why do you people like to call God over nonsense? You are calling God to forbid what you, are, what you can't forbid yourself. Eating like your life depends on food. I wonder how many places you have eaten already. You see your life. Sit down here and be eating. Listen to me. A man will eventually come to make inquiries on your head. And I will sit that man down and give him a low down of the kind of useless sister I have. What are you doing? How, can, how could you be eating like this? So stupid and senseless. Go to the village. Tell my mother I sent my greetings. And that I will do everything within my powers to come and see her soon. Okay? Brother, this is just 50,000 naira. And so? But I told you. Mama has been admitted in the hospital already. Uh -huh. Good measure. This money will not be enough. They demanded for a deposit of 100,000 naira, which we have already borrowed. Not to even talk about the other expenses. Yet you gave me just 50,000 naira. Most of the time when you, when you sound this way, I begin to wonder, am I the only one she gave birth to? Are you not a daughter? What's your problem? But seriously, I don't understand you. I don't understand you. 
Do you know this money will not be enough? You know it. Then you complete the money. Complete the money and pay. If you complete this money and pay, this is what I have. If you complete this money and pay, will the hell stop to exist? I'm asking you. Will you stop to exist? <clears throat> Brother, why is this that? Each time we ask you for money, she will always react this way. Why? How well? How well? You must you remind me of my predicament, brother? What is this predicament? You know I don't have money because if I do, I won't even come here the first place to ask for money. I want to have money. Listen to me. What you have here is what I have in my house that I've given you. If you like, bring out your two eyes down here. More money will never come out. I have given you what I have. If what I have given you is not enough, you complete this money. Let me tell you something. I don't want to meet you here when I return today. I already planned how I'm going to spend this week. And Ugoshi was never included in that budget. So the same way you bundled yourself into this house, try and bundle yourself back to where you came from. Because if I come back and you are still here, you will not like how I'm going to handle you. money we are talking about is not for my personal use. It is not for my personal use to settle Mama's hospital bill. And I've given you what I have for you to settle the bill. Go ahead and settle the bill. What's your problem? Every time she's telling me that uh, it reminded me of my predicament. What predicament? You have your hands, you have your legs. Why can't you make money? What's your problem? I'm you Gucci. Does it mean you have been giving it to them free of charge? Is it free you have been giving it to them? Or are you telling me to my face that my sister is so useless that men are taking her free of charge? She can't even have money to pay for normal bills. Just so, so because I have money, I, I, I will have to kill myself because I have a sister like you. God punish you there. Don't, don't, stop making me angry. Until I come back and you are still here, you will not have to be Finds beauty in the whole of Ontario. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's been a did you travel? For where? No work. You know, grimy. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. Ah, she just came with Mama day before yesterday. You mean you left Mama at home? Uh -uh. Don't you know who my mother is? Stop <laughs> born. She said, what would she be doing in the midst of women that do nothing but gossip? <laughs> <laughs> my dear, Salum has been branded as a place of gossip. Do I don't her? blame her. No, we talk with the talk. So, not so, my dear. <laughs> Please, eh, you see this here? I'm tired. I need something refreshing. What about that eh, Afro human hair we talked about? Okay, I have it. Uh -huh. Please. Neta. Quick, quick, quick. quick. Please, let me that hair to the door. Excuse me. What do you think you're going to do? You want to abandon me here? Yeah? No, I'm sorry. Auntie. Let me just get I'm coming back. Madam Grace, is this how you treat your customers? Please don't be offended, yeah? Um, Neka, please continue with her. Let me get it myself. Mm. It's okay. I'm going to take my
everybody run out of the house now. Okay. Madam, I don't stay here since now. See me see the gate. Nobody I don't come in, nobody I don't go out. Someone was at the house. The doors were opening and slamming. Okay, okay, what up? <laughs> now the cook, Uva. It's not the cook. Yes? Yeah. The cook is off duty. She's not even at home. Okay, madam, now you don't make me the fear. Eh? I don't stay here since now. Nobody I don't come out, nobody I don't come inside. It's not open for anybody. Search the whole compound. I need to be sure. Please. Go on, search. Out there was just not about it. That's your business. <sighs> but Annabelle, it's not like the girl was asked to leave you and attend to her. I just hate the way she carries herself about in town. <laughs> Listen, Uchu. it's not her fault. If you marry a man as wealthy as Udubandu, I'm sure you will do more. You will do worse. I know you. You know that's not true. He is just the complete opposite of her. He's very humble and accommodating. Ha! Huh. I wish all rich men were like that. Listen, Annabelle. I beg of you, do not hate her. Because Uju Bundle is the reason why we're still employed in that bank. If you continue to hate the wife, she might talk to the husband in withdrawing from my bank. And you know what a cherish customer. She doesn't know me, so no worries. And there's no freaking way she would ever find out how close her husband is to me or to us. You think so? Do not get it twisted. This world is a small place. <sighs> Would you? Right now, I'm so not okay. So just spare me the salmon. Cut the crap. What is always huh? wrong with you? When we're talking, you're always not in the mood. What is it? Why are you getting angry? I'm not angry. I, think. I just have issues with her. Ugh. I'm not angry with you. I just have issues with her arrogant persona. Listen, it's not her fault. You shouldn't just, she should be the least of your worries. You know why? Because she does not even know you exist. Yes, she doesn't know you exist.
<laughs> Mama has come again. This one is Mama's funny story, part twenty. <laughs> Mama. There is absolutely no way all these things you have just said is possible. How can doors be opening and slamming just like that? It's not possible. Amanda, if I were a child, I would have run out of this house today with what I saw. There was this figure that looked like a woman. Even the gate man tried to make me believe I didn't see anything, but I know what I saw. I'm a me fanful. <laughs> Mama. I have lived in this house for three years and nothing of what you have just described, nothing like it has ever happened. I've never experienced such mysterious... I don't even know what to say. It has never happened though. I don't... Are you sure you're not hallucinating? More about you. Hallucinate. Well, how else would I explain what you have just told me? Those can't just be slamming and opening on their own free will. It's not possible. Uh, please, sister. I am going to sleep. I don't have time for Mama's visions. Hmm? I need to go and rest. So, Amanda, I'm not going to eat. Please sit. What is happening now? How? Oh, don't be, be, pretend as if you don't know what I'm talking about. Huh? Mama, I don't know what you're talking about, except if you're still talking about doors opening and slamming. Uh -huh. You said I was hallucinating. I agree. But what is happening with you and Emeka? You've been married for three years now, yet no cry of a baby. Uh... Nothing is happening. It's, it's bothering me, but no uh, refrain I really want to the hospital to check if all is well. Every time we've been going, we've been going, we're hoping and believing God for now. Amanda, you talk of God. Do you still know God? Do you still pray? Of course, Mama, I still know God. I Since you. I came to this house, all you concern yourself with is, is business, fashion, clothes. What else? Mama, I still know God. I still pray. True. You can't lie to yourself. You've totally forgotten about God. And that is the worst thing that can happen to any Christian. You need God, Mom. You need God. Be cool. Oh? Okay, Mama, I'll, I'll try my best. I'll keep praying for you. Oh, I thank God that you married a wealthy husband. I don't want that to get into your head. Oh, okay, it's well. You know what? Thank you. One man. I'm not busy. My dear. Catch it all. I'm beyond lucky. I am blessed. I'm blessed to have Udu as my husband. You don't, you don't understand how happy I am. I'm telling you. But I, just, I just wonder why those women, his ex-wives, I wonder why they left him. Well, from all you have told me about him, I don't think any woman that finds herself with him will want to leave. If I tell you it doesn't bother me, it's, I'll be lying. It really worries me. Udu is every woman's dream. I mean, what doesn't he have? He's such a nice man with a gentle heart. Why would any woman want to leave him? Who don't like Betati? Come on. That shouldn't bother you. Sometimes in life we make wrong choices before getting it right. So, let's just say Udu made the wrong choices with the previous women. Before he finally found his
Yes, yes, I'm fine. I can't stand the and you didn't I'm fine, I just drifted, that's it. Um, what is it? Okay, um, tell her I'll join her shortly. I'm coming. I'm coming. Maybe that. Why be that now? Nah? You know, get the name. This kid doesn't say he be this. He just know he know they talk. Even as a gate man, you live in a room that even thriving businessmen cannot afford. Do you in your wildest dream think this is ordinary? Somebody don't know, I know they see, now you don't need to know. Eh? This thing you don't need to know, I'm going to play. Eh? Wait, eh? I roasted you. Please come and carry these things, please. You're even taking Chiamaka along, and you know I always I'm always lonely whenever Emeka travels. What 
It's okay. I can't force you. It's just that Emeka would have loved to see you when he returns from Dubai, but no, no problem. What is it? It be like say something he don't spoil. Spo something he don't go wrong go. What has gone wrong? <laughs> but I mean, you know say he did inside he won't follow me that time. He did for my room. I hear no. I come out. I don't see anybody. Some more time when they hear voice. I know they see anybody. And a woman voice. What woman? Who are you talking about? Madam, it, it be like saying that that woman when they walk out from compound, they walk out, they walk out, they wear white. What? What? What are you talking? Who madam, walks around the compound doing what? Uh, see, madam, I don't see him face so more. The woman is fine. He fine like you. Will you shut up and tell me what exactly your problem is? Hey, madam. I they tell you, he don't do work out, he don't do hear voice, he don't work out, he don't work out. He just be like, say, the house, he don't do condemn, he don't do tongue condemn the house. Everybody, they work out. Musa. Madam. Come. I said, come. Musa, let it not be that you have smoked something or drank something. Because I will deal with you and I will throw you out of this compound. Shut up! Do not say a word. All I want from you is to be alert at all times. Do your job and at night you sleep, wake up and continue. That is what you're paid to do. Now, out of the sight. Do not utter a word. Do not utter a word. Get out. I said don't say a word. Now, they think they don't despoil. Nobody believes me. <laughs> Baby, 
Yes, every you don't need worker. You worker. You don't talk. You don't need hear voice. You don't need tell everybody. There's something you don't need spoil nobody. When everything you don't spoil, bata bata. That time they will come home. Who's that? Wait till you see. I will say me. You don't see anything. Mama, you're getting me confused there. Why did you order the driver to stop us there, Mama? As I sat in that car, the same aura that enveloped the house was visibly present in the car. That was why I asked the driver to stop us, so that we can continue the journey on our own. You're sounding weird, Mama. What are you talking about again? Chiamaka, something is happening in that house. And even Amanda is not aware of it. Something like what? I think her house is being haunted. <laughs> Mama, you are getting me scared. How can sister's house be haunted? <laughs> what she needs is prayers. Yes. They should be fine. Mama, you are getting me scared. Imago Tachi Amaka. You see, what an elder sees sitting. A child standing on the mountain top will never see it. Mama, you're getting me scared. What she needs is prayers. Mama, you are getting me scared. I am going to say the Holy Ghost prayers at your cousin. <laughs> she will be fine. You are talking as if the situation is really bad now. From what I saw and felt in that house, the situation is terribly bad. because you are a goat and your father was a cow. That is why you don't have anything inside your brain that every day you're causing trouble here. Why are you pushing me? Do you want me to kill you before your time? Imagine, oh, will I run away from you just because you are my, you are, you are my neighbor? Every day is either one problem or another. I got more freaking alive now. And I know the game plan. You want to provoke me so I can slap you and be fine. You know the rules of the market that I cannot slap anybody in the market. But do me a favor. Try this nonsense when the market is closed and let me kill you and bury you somewhere. Idiot. Okuloka, you have expired. You, you, you are only Okuloka when it, when it comes to wickedness. On your job. Bo, I don't know. What the fuck is wrong with you? I'm going to be here, man. What do you want to do? 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 You look at me to say that I am expired in the Monday. Ha! If I kill this man now, he'll be a grizzly, man. I don't This man has finished me. This man has finally made me very irrelevant in this market. I used to be the highest. I used to be the one people praise because I was the richest. I used to be the Okuro car of Onisha Do. I earned that name. Now the name has become meaningless. All because that bastard, that useless orphan thinks that he can throw his word around and bribe the people. Ana Boyudu Bondo. Oneko. Oneko. What is it? Leave our husband alone! Yes, leave our husband alone or I will not leave you. What are you talking about? I am, I'm not with your husbands. Who is talking about husbands? Eh? We are talking of the same man. Leave him alone for us! Uh, uh, what are you talking about? Which husband are... Ah! 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 Thank God. 
It's a dream. Oh, God, please. Please, oh. Hmm. Udubondul is a very lucky man. I seriously wonder why you are calling it luck. I don't understand it. You and I know that as far as a mecha would do is concerned, that luck does not exist. Why are you talking like this? This is the same person we have known almost all our lives. We can still remember how his parents died the same day. And how his uncle, who was supposed to take care of him, threw him out, rejected him. Now we know about all this. It's not news. And you, you will still remember how he labored under his master, who settled him with practically nothing. And how he stronghold at the Mbuka market, feeding from hand to mouth. What? Let me ask you, why are you recounting all this? I, 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 am, I am telling you all this for you to understand you are very wrong when you say a maker who do is a lucky man. So, what point are you trying to make? Now you are asking the right question. I want you to look deeper. And you will realize that that same man we call our friend, a maker who do, the Pondo man of Abdo, there is something wrong somewhere. The same man that was struggling from hand to mouth suddenly has become so rich in this hour on a shower that those of us that made money before him are now looking like babies before him. And you are telling me that everything is normal? Does that make sense? <laughs> exactly my point. And that's why I said he's a very lucky man. Luck finally smiled at him. Oh, What's the problem? Oh, man, careful, Nanya. This has nothing to do with luck. There is something wrong somewhere. Why are you not seeing it? Okay, for whatever it is worth, I am happy for him. At least if not for anything, for the fact that you and I don't have to contribute money for him to eat or to help him. Honestly, I am happy for him. I am. How I wish I can say the same. Unfortunately, I can't. Because his affluence, you know, his affluence is now like a threat. Can you imagine one of these boys in the men market looking me in my face to tell me that I, Okuloka Nonechado, am not old school. Simply because in his judgment, I am not as generous as uh, Udubando. Can you imagine that kind of insult? Okay, now I see your point. That bothers you, doesn't it? But really, I don't think you should be bothered. Forget about that. Those boys in the market are laid back and they can say all nasty things about everything, everybody. Listen, everyone cannot be a Dubondo. You cannot be a Dubondo. Everyone gives according to how his heart directs him. Seriously, you've been careful, Naya. I am very bothered. I am very, very bothered because his generosity is detrimental to me. Uh, I think very detrimental to me, and uh, Udupondu is beginning to take the shine off me in the same market. Okoro, if you ask me, I think you should forget about all that. I don't think that one is a problem. Yeah? Listen, let's talk about something else. Please, just drink it. Let's talk about something else. Hello, IJ. Well, good morning, Annabelle. <laughs> How may I help you? Oh, I'm here to see your boss. Well, he's not back yet. Back from where, please? You mean you don't know? He traveled to Dubai. Oh, really? Yes. Um, when is he likely to be back? He will be back before the week runs out. could not even tell me that he was traveling. Huh. Are you okay? Oh, I'm fine. I guess I'll check back within the week. Okay. Do mm. have a nice day. Thank you. You too. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Do have a nice day. Nenwea. Professional prostitutes. 
Honestly, pretty, I am worried. I believe it's not. Just one of those dreams. No, 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 no. I wish I could say the same, but I don't I don't feel it's just one of those things because I know a pastor that said it's not good to have nightmares during the day. I'm sure it's one of those his ex-wives. Eh? Why are they after me? Why do they want to kill me? My dear, I don't see any reason why your husband's ex-wives would want to harm you. They left on their own and not the other way around. My gate man is not even helping matters. Your gate man? Yes! He keeps talking about this particular woman that wanders around the compound. That's scary. What do you mean by a woman wandering around the compound? I am just as lost as you are, but that's what he keeps saying. Although I have not set my eyes on this so-called strange woman wandering the compound, eh? I've even tried to dismiss him. Because after he smokes that thing that he smokes, he says things that are not. But he's, he seems as if he's sure of what he's saying. <laughs> Why are you laughing? This is not a laughing matter. <laughs> Pardon me, my beautiful Amanda. It's very disturbing that you have allowed the submission of that drug addict to bother you. Are you, do you really think he's acting or talking under the influence of that thing that he smokes? I don't just think. I know. You better don't allow yourself to be bothered by that your gate man. Don't ignite the fire and force me to ignite the one that will burn you. Which can no sense be this now, eh? You know no see my body temperature, you don't go up. Now this thing needed to bring it there. Where he goes, he make a no put fire. Your words are regarded as nothing because you smoke banned substances. I just warned you madly. Do not allow me to warn you the hard way. Okay. What do you do you? What do you do you? Who I be this woman now? What do you do you? Eh? Okay, I mean. Make a smoke it half, make a give half for you. I know you smoke it all. Eh? What is wrong? Since I came back, I noticed you've been looking worried and distant. Did anything happen while I was away? No, nothing, no, nothing happened. You know I know you too well. So tell me the truth. Your husband is the cash man of this town. To tell me. Why did your ex-wives leave you? Why they left? Or why I send them away? No woman has the capacity to live with the bundle. Okay. Uh, why did you send them away? Well... You know me well. I'm not a cruel or violent man. So I couldn't just have sent them away for no just cause. Exactly. I... I, I was, I'm just baffled because I know you're a very good man with a good heart. So I'm, I'm wondering why any woman would want to leave you. Why are you consistently twatting history? They did not leave me, I sent them away. Okay, why? Why did you send them away? Tell me, please. You see, I... I don't think you should worry yourself over that. All those women are all in my past now. They were agents of darkness sent to destroy me. What? Oh yes. After so many trials, 
the goddess post and I send them packing. Okay, tell me, how did that happen? <laughs> you mean you just... You married different women at different times and just realized all of a sudden that they... They, they were witches. Witches? But the bondo man of only child, Akalemfa. How? <laughs> Your husband is a very powerful man. The spirits that guide me are very strong. Seriously, you have to explain. You need to tell me how it all happened. Because you, oh, you're, you're trying to tell me that you just woke up one day and the wives you married were just, just turned to witches? They all came from the same kingdom. They got caught when they wanted to ruin me. How, how did it happen? <laughs> well... Why been here? It is very deep. You won't understand. Baby, believe me, you don't have anything to worry about. They are all in my past. Really? Don't worry for any man. I can't even walk, I can't walk, I can't walk. Only if you feel it, if you feel it, if you feel death does not give no tears. No matter the cold you come from, I got you covered. Umaro. Yes, Ijoma. What are the priority things I have to attend to immediately? Well, sir, James was here during the week and he brought the bookkeeping for the warehouse at 34 Bright Street. So you need to go through the book, sir. I have already spoken to him about it. Let me have it. Is there anything? These are the mails and people that checked on you while you were away. We'll, we'll talk about it. Next. We'll keep this in And the bank lady came here to check on you too. Which of them? Annabelle Okori. Alright, um, I can't remember having an appointment with her. What did she say? She said she would check back before the week runs out, sir. Alright. Now, tell all those people within for me that um, I will not be giving out credit notes today. Okay. I need to clear my table and uh, attend to other hanging issues, okay? And again, um, I will go on an inspection to the carpet house, alright? Okay, sir. We have some loads of carpet coming in. So I need to get to Gab right away. And again, uh, call my house. Tell them I will not be in the office for lunch. All right, sir. All right. Thank I'm just coming from a visit uh, to one of my warehouses. On my way to this market, I met some people singing with your name. Oh, uh, I didn't see them, but I heard. What was it all about? 
Uh, nothing serious. Uh, some of those guys I give goods to on credit. You know how people can exaggerate certain things. What I did this time around was to extend the larger heart to them by giving some goods they are not expected to pay for. Udu. Udu bundle. Have you lost it completely? Why would you do a thing like that? Oh, yeah, Chuku Gozi. Gozi, bear. Chuku Bale Christmas. E Bale one day. On your free fair, you leave fair. If you forgot, you leave. I'm just expressing the way I feel in my spirit by giving. Udu Bando, there is something you have to realize. These same people you are showing so much concern to, these same people you are giving your goods, expecting them not to pay back, they are the ones that will one day arrange and kidnap you. <laughs> why, why, why are you exposing yourself to risk? <laughs> kidnap Udu Bando. What for? Listen to me. Kidnappers only go for those nowadays, yeah? those who do not give. Not for people like me who have a large heart. But brother, if God has given you, you owe it a responsibility to mankind to give. That's it. Udo, I am only advising you. As a friend, a true friend, be very careful how you go spreading money to people. Who are danger? Look, Okuru, million a day is We need to spread the wealth, not poverty. Huh? Okuru, welcome. That's just it. That's a script. Good do. Life in America was wonderful. I can tell. <laughs> Little wonder you spent almost three months. You know, at the point I thought you had relocated, or that one Akata had captured your heart. Aneji do doguno do. They can capture somebody else, not someone like me. Hey, hey, Udu, go and be fed, man. I heard that you would settle Chika soon. I wish you talking about soon. It is this Sunday. Is you good? Yes. Udu Bondo. Okay. Okay, Karaka. Only I need to come and money. That's all. I want it till Laura. Hey. You say, baby. My name is. You are trying. My brother. The way you settle your boy, sir. I wish I could do the same. My brother. Good work deserves good reward. Is you. I have been exceptionally lucky with loyal boys. And uh, Chika is a very good boy. Yes. Tell me, what are your plans for him? Well, um, for a start, I'll give him the shop at 34 Bright Street yeah. and 5 million naira cash. Udubondo! Hey! I'm a man! Hey! I'm a man! 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 I'm a Oh, madam is fine. Uh, so so bomo you know. Ozuru <laughs> faro. They are the same everywhere. <laughs> but brother, mm -hmm. come and show me the machine you brought. Ah, uh, Udu. It is not uh, like you don't have them already. Come follow cable. I will let let me know. I don't want to see. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Jeff. Why are you not allowing us to see the boss? The bundle is not only your guy. The bundle is also your bundle. Okay, man, we are going to need it. We are here to collect credit notes. We are, we are, we are. Come here now, Mr. Kajeleben. Listen, guys. I am not preventing you guys from seeing the boss. We well, just that there is no credit note today. Madam, Maka, why? Now this guy is not here. Who's here in Bombay? No. We need the credit notes. Anyway, in that case. You guys should come back tomorrow. Maka give it. He is not giving out any credit note. Can't you hear me? Let not be a ham boy. Hmm. Have you seen my mother? No, 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 no. Please, you guys should stand here. 
Someone like that. What is wrong with you? Uh, Madam, I'm sorry. I don't come, but I didn't answer call. I know if you talk about the way they talk to me, I they talk. You know, go, know who I they call. Uh, Madam, you get one missus, he did for outside gate. He said he want to see you. Missus? Eh, uh, missus. I am not expecting anyone. Who, who, who? What does she look like? Did you ask her? Who is she? Where is she from? Eh, uh, madam, I never see this missus for here before. He no know the face. But they call out when he were. He be like the one that woman when he, they work out for company. They, they work out, they work out, they work out, they wear. Shut up, Musa! I am not expecting anyone. Just dismiss her. I have to do this for him. If not, those goods will be destroyed. Can go in with you. Almost all his papers are to the apple. And that's what these custom boys do not tolerate. Actually, I should have done this before now, but it was delayed by my trip to the United Arab Emirates. Udo, let me ask you a question. Do you really want to do this for him? Do you really want to take this kind of risk for a man like Oko? Why not? Is he no longer a friend? I can do this for an enemy. What more a friend? Well, I, I don't dispute that, but I don't think you should take such a risk for a man like Oko. Huh? I don't think at all. Oko is not worth that risk. Uh, have you considered what a risk to your reputation if these customs guys hit you. I don't worry about that. I got that under my control. A lot of the custom boys are my payroll. Okuru knows that. That's why he came to me. Well, I can sell you to tread carefully. Thanks for your concern. But I can do that for a friendship. Sure. But I can sell you to it's okay, it's okay. So, can we go now? Yeah. Yes. Stop. But I'll stop by my shop to pick. Eh, madam, you go one day go. Eh? Eh, madam say you know they expect any visitor today, ever. Go back and tell her that I know why her husband's ex wives left. Okay, eh, say? I know you have not smoked any of your banned substances today. Hey, me, Nini. I sure say no be you be the person. I don't they work hard, they work hard, they work hard inside this one point disease. Go and do like you are told. Hey. Oh, for God's sake. What is it, Musa? What is wrong with you this morning? But then make a full temper, make a full temper. That me says when they outside, he doesn't say make it dismiss it. He say make a come back, make it tell you, say, you know why all of your wife, when he don't marry, all of them they don't go. What? 
What? But then make it know it's not me. Now the missus, he don't talk it to tell you. But then that will make it say he be one jiva. You don't know how it is. Madame. What kind of rubbish is this, Musa? Okay, madam, I leave him for here. Come, come inside. Come, come, call you. Okay. Musa, you have started smoking that rubbish that makes you hallucinate, right? <laughs> you have. Hey, wait here, you. Madam, well, I... Now here it... What is shut your mouth? Stupid boy. Or oh, man. I don't even know what to call you. Hey, madam, I stand for here. Me, I won't stand for here. I won't... Shut up! This will be the last time you try this rubbish with me. Have you heard me? How can you just call someone out and, and, and make a fool of me outside here? Are you alright? Madam Nadia is there. I said shut up. Madam Nadia is there. Nadia is there. My friend, shut up and close that gate. Nadia is there. She won't stand for you. He won't say make a go for you. Wait here you do. Eh? Wait here you do. <laughs> he don't talk and say like this woman. <laughs> Then they work hard, they work hard, they work hard. This woman is being winged. They say, hey, no, if you don't hold up, I go this shot to my Adam, my Adam. If you don't let them go. Eh? Hey, wait till you do. Wait till you do. You don't have to slap. Who are you? How did you get into my house? Who are you, who are you looking for? Hey, 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 hey! Don't come any closer. If you do, I will call the police. What do you want? Who are you looking for? Don't do anything foolish, Amanda. You know my name? I was at your gates. She wouldn't let me in, and so I let myself in. What do you want from me? Good question. What do I want from you? Amanda, I want you to leave this house. What? You must leave because you do not belong here. You must leave Udubondo immediately. Who are you? And who do you think you are to tell me what to do in my house? I am someone you don't want to see again. Do as you are told. Leave Udu. You will never have a child with me. I will never have a child with me. What are you talking about? Even if you live all your life with me, you will never have a child. But I won't let you laugh with that look. Don't make me come back here, Amanda. You will not like it if I do. Leave Udu. Leave him while we can. Listen to me, yes, it cannot happen. I am not aware of any meeting where that decision was taken. I am not aware of any such meeting at all. I know that you are not aware of it. But I thought that you are in total support of it. Nonsense. How can I be in support of such nonsense? How can a human being support people to remove him from his office before the end of his tenure? And I mean, I mean, 
they argued that they needed a man that is financially supportive and one that is credited. What kind of nonsense argument is that? No, how could you even say that? When we formed this union, we decided on what qualifies the man to be the chairman. We know what it is. There is never a time we say that any idiot that is throwing money about is qualified to be chairman. I don't know. Where did you get it from? Where is it from? You wonder, let me tell you something. This man here is a worker. I am the chairman of that union and I want you to go back to those idiots that are holding me to remove me that it's not possible. I have to stay until the end of my tenure. This is very disgraceful. You know what? Thank you so much for coming. I really appreciate it. Just go and tell them what I said. Please, just, just go. So I have to go to your shop. Go to back to your shop. Thank you for coming. You see what I'm saying? You the bundle has finished. The bundle has finished. Where am I going to hide my face in this market? That I am removed from my place and the bundle has become the chairman. And in the end, and in the end, everything is under control, sir. From her symptoms, it is obvious she suffered from a severe shock, which caused the fainting. Shock? How could that be? What did you say that happened to her? The security man told me he found her unconscious in our living room. It's alright. All she needs now is bed rest. She'll be fine. Thank you, doctor. My pleasure. Uh, can I see her now? She's still a bit unconscious and must be allowed to wake up on her own. That means I can't see her? Of course you can. But she must not be disturbed. Thank you, Doctor. It's my pleasure. Hulu, Hulu, Tempa. If you Hulu, Tempa. Hulu, my Tempa. Hulu, Tempa. Hulu, Tempa. Shake it, Hulu, Tempa. Hulu, my Tempa. Hulu, Tempa. I see this you. <laughs> Which game for all of it is? <laughs> that this game fire this woman is just saying with him. <laughs> Thank you so okay. You don't pay me for this thing. <laughs> what did I do you? <laughs> I know you're a bad person. You know. What did I do this woman? <laughs> what did I do you? You know what? I'm killing me. What did I do you? Hey baby, pull over. Hey baby, pull over. Hey, don't pull it. Knock them, bagam. Bagam. You don't like it, bagam. Knock them, bagam. Shake it. Knock them, bagam. Hmm. Bagam. Nah, you don't get it. One, two, three. You don't fold it. This way, it will take me morning, afternoon, and evening, boy. Okay. Hey, knock them, bagam. Okay, basically, they go for me, no credit quarters. Hey, we go one smoke, I know who my later. Shake it. <laughs> hey, baby, pull over. Okay, baby, pull over. Neck them, bugger. He go there, he say. Pull over. Hey, baby, 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 pull over. Baby, pull over. You scared nonsense won't be this one now. Eh? Who won't come out to the team when I won't take pull of my body this afternoon? Eh? Stop giving me the impression that you are a fool. Don't make me kill you before your time. <laughs> hey! This woman, you don't come back again. He don't come back. Eh? What did he do? Eh? He never, the thing he went to pull on my body, he don't get it. See later. Because he don't say you don't get it. See it. Make him go smoke. I know they come out for here. I did for here. He won't do this thing, make a phone go not. Where we go around, he don't think you do headquarters. Then he have to pick 
No. When she wakes up, she will tell us. My body confused. What kind of trouble is this? Sister, sister, please open your eyes. Just let her be, let her be. In our situation in life, we are encouraged to put our trust in God. I know that her situation has something to do with the way I was feeling when I was there. Amanda is very important to me. I don't want to lose her. I believe she'll be all right. But we have to get her to experience the sacrament of holy matrimony by getting married properly to her man. Now she's living with a man in the same house without getting wedded in a church. No, we do not consider her as married. Father, I know that. But what I don't know is why Emeka has refused to wed my daughter. It's not that he doesn't have money. He can even call for a society wedding if he wants to. But why he has refused to, to, to wear that still baffles me. Well, I will continue to pray for her. But you have to do your job as a mother. Let them know that they are living in immorality by living together and not getting married first in the church. We cannot invoke God to act as God in their case. People must live according to the doctrines of God so that they can benefit from the miracles of His mercy. Is it so bad that you can't talk about it? It's not as if I don't want to talk about it. The fact is, I can't remember anything. Sister, I don't understand you. You fainted, and I've been here for two days now. Yet, you can't tell anybody what happened. I can't remember anything. I have tried. My head, I can't remember a it single is. thing. It's okay. Don't stress yourself, okay? Get well first. Hi, darling. The doctor says we can take you home today. Home? No, no. No, 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 no. I don't want to go back to that house, please. Don't even mention it. I don't want to go. Sister Amanda. Eh, hey, hey, be gone. Don't call me. I don't want to go back to that house. Why don't you want to go home? It's your home. I know it's my home, but I don't want to go back. I'm scared. Yes. I don't know. I just don't want to go back, please. Let me stay here. Hello, Mama. Um, Chiamaka. The priest has blessed the holy oil for her. Would you come to pick it up? Mama, she's okay now. I don't think we need the anointed oil. Chiamaka, please. You need the oil. Come back and pick it up. Your sister is up against some spiritual forces and she needs the oil. Be cool. Okay, Mama. I will see what I can do. Okay. I am as surprised as you are. Believe me, I did not see this coming. But why would they take this kind of decision without consulting any of us? Seriously, it beats me. From what I heard, they are looking for a sheer man who can support the union financially and one who is credible. Oh, come on. Forget these are trade union people. Anyway, I, I don't think they are serious. Not when they have already sent me a letter demanding my immediate resignation. To that? Yes. This is serious. They could have allowed me to at least accept the offer. Wait a minute. 
Are you confirming to me that you have not accepted? Where? Because the letter I got didn't state that. But from what I read, they said you have accepted. That they're just waiting for me to resign so that they can organize your inauguration. Are you saying you have not accepted? Oh, how could you ask me that? That's politics. That's politics. I can remember vividly that two of the executives mentioned something like that to me before I went to Dubai. And I told them to maintain the status quo until I get back. And I forgot entirely about it until now you mentioned it. Okay. Now that it has become this serious, what are you going to do? Because it is very clear that every single body, every single person in that executive is already bought. Going by the way you have gone around throwing money in the whole of Anichado. Oh, come on. Don't talk like that. This is something we can sort out. Don't be judgmental. You've already found me guilty. Listen to me. We have come way back. I'm going to get the go. You must not allow this trade union you know, thing coming between us. Nothing like this must be allowed to strain our relationship. I couldn't have them throw you out like that and take your position. What for? Makaligo Modifa. We must find a way of sorting this out, but I don't think this is the right way to go about it. my house. Mama asked me to make sure I rub the oil everywhere so that any evil force around will be chased away. Who on earth told you I have evil forces in my house? Mama thinks so. Mama thinks so. What have you been telling her? Me? Nothing, no sister, nothing. Come on, will you stop rubbing that rubbish right now? What is your problem? I'm still talking to you, you're going ahead painting my house with trash. What's wrong with you? Are you alright? I'm sorry, sister. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Sister, what is going on? I know you can talk to me. You've been acting strangely since that fainting incident. <gasps> I. There's, there's nothing wrong. I, 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 I guess I'm still traumatized. That's it. Not, nothing. Sister, I have this funny feeling that you are trying to hide something from me, and even from Mama. <laughs> Why would I lie to you? I fainted. Nothing more. I haven't rested in a long time. I, you know, I work too hard. So, that's it. Really? You want me to believe that, sister? You want me to lie to you? There's no other logical reason why I should faint. It's just... I just need to rest a lot more. Okay. Yeah. If you say so, then I believe you. I love you, sister. Hey! <laughs> I love you too, but don't touch me with that. Just take it far away from me. Let me go. Okay. Madam, this one is you not know, tall, is you not know, short. It's just today. Eh. 
and the one you said that wanders outside the gates. Okay, okay, madam, that one, you know they come again. That one, I can't look for you there, that you know they come again. I mean, the one you just described, is she the same person that's been looking for me? Okay, uh, madam, uh, if I bring them together, uh, they won't resemble. Eh? But the other one, uh, they work out, work out for the compound. That one, I know the two show in face. That one, before I know, I don't disappear for her. Eh, uh, but madam, any problem? I just said no problem. Eh, uh, you won't know whether I make a final for you, madam. Because that day, na me see I won't call you, madam. Me they say, madam, you don't see him now. You know, one telling me say you don't see him because me I don't chop a slab. She didn't tell me. In fact, I didn't even know when she left the house. I know that something is done with Amanda. That's why I sent you there to monitor and take care of her. Now you don't even know where she is. I can only try. Don't forget that she's married and is living with her husband. I am just a younger sister, Mama. A husband that is hardly at home with her? Since you got there, how many times have you seen a make at home? Hmm? You're right, Mom. He is hardly at home. It is either one business or another. I will just call her later. <laughs> okay, bye, Mom. Mama will always forget that we are all adults now. She will always want to control us as if we are still children. <laughs> you don't see. What is the meaning of that? Who is this strange woman? I am convinced I saw a ghost. I can swear on that. You're speaking too late. Why didn't you say this all this while? You don't believe me? I was completely lost. It was just this afternoon I had flashes of the events and I called my gates man. He confirmed that it's that same woman that's moving around the compound. Jesus. What are you going to do now, my friend? Do you think it's one of Emika's ex-wives? No, 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 I don't think so. She cannot be. Because she says she knows the reason why they left. If she was one of them, she couldn't have referred to them as they. You're right. I think you should let your husband know about it. I mean, he needs to know. The truth is that the more I try to understand you, the more confused I get. Why haven't you spoken about this all this while? Baby, I told you I was completely lost. I couldn't remember anything up until this afternoon. I see. Well, the description of the woman you said you saw I don't know her. And I've not had anything to do with any woman of such description. Why then did she tell me to leave you? Strange. 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 How did she know you were married before? She also claimed to know why your ex wives left. She knows you very well. 
She says that. Enough. Enough of this nonsense. Can you listen to yourself? That a ghost came to my house? How long have you been here? Three years plus. And you're talking this rubbish. I know what I'm saying. I know what I am saying. I saw her. You can ask the gate man. He can bear me witness. Oh. See what you're doing to yourself. You have degenerated to the level of having discussions with the gate man. The same gate man, you know, smokes Indian hemp. I'm very disappointed in you. It's not it all. Because the gate man came to me and told me he saw her. I didn't believe him until she came to me. I saw her. I know what I'm saying. I'm telling you the truth. You know what? I think you're fast losing it. Put a check on it before you lose it completely. There's nothing you're hiding. Leave these girls alone. Let them go and get married. They were confusing you. It is Adam that's all. Yes. No, 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 no. You can't do that. You can see I have a visitor. Okay. And please, the right thing to do is you must clean my office before I get here. No, 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 no. Don't go anywhere. Udu, no need to send her out. It is still too early for us to start discussing this mad people. Let me go to my shop. I will come back later for us to discuss. Oh. Let her continue her case. Go ahead, Nadia. Go ahead. Go ahead. Udu, go to the Please, uh, be fast, be fast. 